Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and thanks for checking out episode four, season two of Worship Paddleboard on a Budget. If you don't know about the series, let me catch up really quick. We are trying to find a complete rig from guitar to pedals to amp for worship, all for a thousand dollars Canadian or less. We did a series one, which was $500, but then we thought, what can we do with a thousand dollar rig? Hopefully it is twice as good and sounds twice as good. So as you might have noticed, it is guitar week. I picked up a guitar and we're gonna get to that in just a moment. But to recap, where we have come from. Uh, our first uh, purchase, we got a whole bunch of stuff uh, for a steal of a deal. So we got a parts caster, we got a Line 6 uh, Spider Amp, we got a two-timer delay, we got a TS7, we got a Boss uh, FE500 volume pedal, which was broken, uh, but was fixed. We also got this uh, capo thrown in there. We got a daisy chain, we got cores thrown in. So we got all of that for $180, and then we sold the stuff we didn't want to put back into the rig. So the parts caster we sold for 50, the Line 6 amp for 100, the two timer delay for 50, and just recently the TS7 we sold for $40. So all of that we sold for 240, bought for 180, sold for 240, so we're up 60 bucks, and I was able to fix that Boss volume pedal. So the volume, the chords capo, all of that stuff we got for positive $60. Last episode we showed you the tuner, the TU3 by Boss. Uh, we spent $30 on and we also spent $80 on a full tone, full drive 3, uh, which is a great uh, overdrive pedal that has a boost on it. Um, so all together, it was at $50 spent so far. So just recently I grabbed this Squire Telecaster by Fender um, and I also got a Fender Frontman 15G amp. I tried to just buy the guitar but the guy said only as a package deal so I bought them for $125. I'll put the ad up on the screen so that you can see it and I was able to sell that amp quickly for 30 bucks. So we are into this guitar now for $95. So everything so far we have spent $145 which means we have $755 to buy a delay a reverb, I'd like another overdrive pedal, and a tube amp. It's got to be tube or nothing. So let's check out this uh, Squire Telecaster. It is on the lower end of the Fender guitars, the Squire uh, guitars on the lower end, but it's going to fit our need. Um, it's, going to, it's going to make uh, some decent sound. I'm not a super fan of the tone. It's not the best tone in the world, but for a low end, cheaper guitar, it's actually pretty good tone. And the playability, it's actually feels pretty good to play. So that's a plus. With the money that we've spent so far, I think that we can probably upgrade the pickups. One of the easiest ways to upgrade your tone and cheapest ways is to get new pickups. So I'm going to be looking on uh, on my used ads uh, for some Telecaster pickups and we'll see where we're at uh, as we pick up some other items. Maybe I can even spring for uh, some new ones. New uh, pickups typically go for about 200 bucks if you want to get some Fender uh, noiseless or something like that. So we'll keep you posted on that but for now this is the clean unaffected tone. Here is the full drive uh, with the uh, just the overdrive on. And with the boost. So, if you want to hear how this sounds compared to other Fender guitars, I happen to have a Mexican uh, Fender on my wall behind me. It's the very first guitar I bought. It's one of my favorites, always will be. 
Um, so Mexican fenders are actually quite good. If you can get your hands on a, a good deal on a Mexican made fender, you're going to have a nice guitar in your hands. Next up, of course, we've got the American Telecaster, which I have right here and we'll compare uh, alongside. American is going to be, you know, a little bit nicer. You've got your nicer woods, you've got your nicer pickups, your nicer electronics and all of that stuff. And then you can go up to uh, the custom shop and get some, you know, multi-thousand dollar guitars uh, if you want to get to that. But for today we're going to compare this uh, Indonesian Squire Telecaster to a Mexican Telecaster and to an American Telecaster. So let's hear how those sound uh, against each other. This is with just the overdrive on the full tone. This is the overdrive plus the boost. Since we don't have an amp yet, uh, we're playing through my Fender Twin uh, until we get an amp for part of this rig. Um, so we've got our guitar, we've got volume, tuner, and one of our overdrives. We spent $145. We are still looking for a reverb, uh, delay, preferably with the tap tempo, uh, a second overdrive, and a tube amp. It's got to be a tube amp. So thanks for watching. If you want to keep up to date on all of the episodes, why don't you hit that subscribe button right now. I also like to do tutorials from time to time. So if there's a song that you would like to do lead for in your home church and you can't seem to find it online, put it in the comments below. I'll do my best to do a tutorial to help you do that. I want to help worship leaders uh, lead worship. So thanks for watching. Appreciate it if you like, share, subscribe, and uh, leave a comment below. And we'll see you next time.